Hello everyone, it's Bubonic Zombie. Welcome back to House of a Thousand Doors, the Palm of Zoroaster. Okay, I'm pretty sure sooner or later I'm going to figure out how that word is pronounced. But, we made it to the other side of the river. And we are going to visit the House of a Thousand Doors. But first, what is this? A map! Okay. We had a map in the, in the last game too. Um... Which always helps. Do we have fast travel? Yes, we do have fast travel. I love games where we can travel just by clicking on different parts. Don't have to go through different doors. In the last game, I didn't realize it was fast travel, so I was going out throughout the house the long way. Uh, good times. Okay. Things are on fire. Okay, we have pruning shears. Click these. That looks like a rose. It is a rose. Ah! Okay. go fireball again but I remember you Kate I'm happy to see you. Gabriel told us you were coming, but we were afraid the house wouldn't let you in. We're in trouble, but we believe you can help us solve the mystery of what's happening and return Harmony to the house. Strange things are taking place all around us. Objects catch fire by themselves. Water boils without a source of heat. And the walls of the house are hot to the touch. And then there are the fireballs. Oh, Kate, they're driving us mad! Okay. Ah, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to look at the journal. Okay. Samund, yes. Okay. Um. Map. Okay, a nice surprise was waiting for me on the other side of the river. A map! I can see the lights in the house, which means they're waiting for me. I must hurry. Samen Lancaster. Samen hasn't changed. He's still a snob with impeccable manners and perfect pronunciation. That said, he is a better mood than the first time I met him. When I last visited the house, Samen was a huge help for, to me, and now it's my turn to help him. I need to find out what the fireballs are and figure out what's going on. Okay. I might not remember everybody's name, but I remember their faces, and these guys are great characters. Okay, what's over here? Hidden object scene. Here we go. And right away, there's the axe. Okay. There it is. Etched in the wood. We have a fire extinguisher. Okay. And Simon left. Book about Tibet on the beach. I'd like to go there someday. Hmm. Have a dragon head. Recently dug up the soil. Do we have anything? No. But... We do have a fire extinguisher to put this out. Ah, flashlight. That'll come in handy. 
then a journal entry. Let's see. Oh, okay. we have a shovel. June 27th, the residents of Cherry Hill told me about a strange park located next to an empty plot of land. I went to the park on my own and what I found surprised me. I expected to see a Victorian mansion behind, beyond its gates, but I saw nothing but an empty expanse of a perfectly smooth surface, as though it was made of glass. Even more astonishing, the ground was warm. I hope my new, my new friend at the Mystery Club can explain this to me. Gabriel promised to tell me about a palace of a thousand windows or something like that and reveal the secret of the park. Okay. I remember at the end of the last game we did have the option of staying and I want to stay but Kate decided to leave. We have a gear. Missing a locket. Matches. Okay. I had a teddy bear when I was a kid. Sam, the boy that lives in a house, probably left it there. Okay. Yes, Sam, the genius boy. Okay. The leaves, do we need to light them aflame? No, okay. Just that would mess with the point of having fire everywhere. Okay, what can we do? Oh, we have a map, yes, and we have stuff to do here in the courtyard. map is very helpful whenever I get lost. Oh, stone. One of these things is not like the other. Anything around here? Oh, found a beyond object. Newspaper. House of a Thousand Doors. Evidence suggests the House of a Thousand Doors has existed for several centuries, as a number of mediums and even novelist Kate Reed have said. Kate Reed is our character, by the way. The edifice is a huge maze with countless rooms, passages, and portals leading to parallel worlds. The house is a kind of purgatory where souls that can't find peace appear from time to time. The Lancasters, a family of mediums living in the mysterious mansion, help these spirits find peace and then rest. People say the house has appeared in cities around the world. Okay. Which is true. By the way, the um, if you haven't watched the first game, um, House of a Thousand Doors Family Secrets, the Lancasters, the, even though they share the same name, um, they're not related to each other. That name pretty much just binds them um, as just like belonging to the house. If that makes sense. Probably doesn't. But if you watch the first game or played the first game, then it makes sense. <laughs> okay. Oh, we can go back to um, the tree. And we have light. Whoops. But we have an eye. Can we take the flashlight back? No. It's just forever shining into the tree. Okay. And we have a hidden object scene. Okay. There's the belt. Okay. It was rolled up. We have a ladder. 
Okay, now where to? Back to the garden, back to the courtyard. Anything will be need. No, it's something dealing with this brick here. Is there an eye? No. Okay. Do we use a ladder to get over? Yes, we do. Okay. Oh, this house has looked better. Okay, so House of a Thousand Doors. Most journalists say I made up the House of a Thousand Doors, but they're wrong. They'll never understand the satisfaction of solving the mystery. I wonder how much the editor... I wonder how much the editor of this newspaper would pay for an article about Bloody Mary or an interview with the artist of the cursed portrait from my last adventure in the house. Passage. This corridor looks like an art gallery, but the paintings are strange. And what's the point of those huge locks? What do they open? I need to find a way to unlock them. I have a feeling that dragon's head we have is one of the locks. Okay. It's this one. Okay. That looks like China. Yep, painting of a Chinese castle. Okay. This one. Is it India? Where did those bees come from and what are they protecting? Perhaps these strange paintings. Okay. Ooh. Painting of Jerusalem. I would like to go there someday. I would like to leave the country someday. But first things first, you need money. Crowbar. Okay. Let's see what's up ahead. Gargoyle missing its eyes. Okay. Oh, here's one eye. Okay. Where else we can go? To the courtyard. Okay. Maybe now we can use this crowbar. Yes. And there's the other eye. Okay. But there's still stuff we can do here. Not sure what. Ah, elephant tusks. I knew that we had the newspaper here, but is that it? Yes, that's it. Okay. Hey, dude! I found your other eye. Okay. And we will take a step into wherever that leads in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.